Welcome to the World of Maps how-to videos. And in this video, we're going to show you how to set up a sales region using our county PowerPoint maps. All of our maps are editable, and one of the most popular maps that we sell are our county maps, and they're often used for setting up a sales region. And in this case, we're just going to take a sampling of it. Of our, these are from our um, county regional maps, and each one of these is an individual map, and it's made up of land and text. You know, so I can pull this out, it's an individual object. I can also ungroup it right here, and you'll see that there's two groupings. One grouping is text right there, and the other is land. So the key often in working with a map like this is your use of grouping and ungrouping. That'll kind of keep things straight. So the object here is someone has set up this map. They sent it to us, and they asked us to change the color of Ohio and also to put a few of the counties along the Kentucky border into yellow because they have some crossovers. So in this case what I would do is just do a simple ungrouping and I'm going to just move the move the text out of the way to get out of the way and I also like sort of pulling this out over here on the side so I'm not affecting anything that's going on over here and I'm going to zoom in a little bit Like so, so we can get in here a little bit better. Now, what I'm going to do is ungroup it. So again, we go back to our. Let's click on it. Ungroup. Okay. Now these are all individual objects, so I can go in here and I can either hold down the Shift key and select them all, or I can just select around them like this grab them all and I'm going to make them a new color so in this case we're just going to make them uh, we'll give them red so they really stand out you can see what's going on but I'm also going to now just select along the border the counties that I know that are changing so these counties right here are going to be yellow so I'm going to go back into my fill I'm going to use my let's bring this in so we can see it my pick color here, color pick, select my yellow, and you notice everything switched over to yellow. So now what I have done is I have changed the color of this county, and I have also changed some of the counties right along the border. I'm going to go all around it, just like this. I'm selecting everything, and to keep this from all sort of becoming a mess, I'm going to regroup it. Okay, so everything is regrouped. I'll now slide it back in. Like so. I might use some of my arrows. And I can kind of get it right in there. Okay, let's zoom back out. Gonna select the text. We're gonna use it from using the outside. If we do just the inside, you'll end up grabbing that one little little name. So we're just gonna grab the outside and we will put that back right where it goes. And there we go. So what we have learned today is we have colored state of Ohio a different color and we also change some of the names right along the border or some of the colors of the counties right along the border so that they reflect uh, the territory in another state. So thanks for joining us today at the World of Maps and learning a little bit about our editable PowerPoint maps for presentations. They're royalty free, easy to customize, and you can download them immediately from our websites. Uh, we have U.S. and Canada maps, world projections, globes, world regions, states and counties, and tons and tons of countries. So thanks. See you next time. Bye-bye.